healthcare in the United States really, really sucks. Hi mamas, my name is Tasha. I'm a first time mom. My baby is about to turn four months old and today is her first day at daycare. I'm on my way from work now. I'm gonna go pick her up right away and today has been very difficult and probably the most heartbreaking day of the whole postpartum. Thankfully my job is chill enough that I can quietly cry at my desk. That is surely what I did for most of the day today. I didn't even have to drop her off, uh, which is good because I think if I had to drop her off at the daycare, I would probably be putting in my two weeks notice right now, but um, thankfully that was my husband's job this morning. But either way, it's very hard. It's very hard to think about the fact that your little baby, not even four months old, is gonna be somewhere away from anyone that she knows. It's very heartbreaking. I keep thinking that she's just gonna think that we left her. She's not gonna know that we're coming back because there's just, there's no explaining that to a little baby. And then I try to reason myself into thinking that I am just very hormonal and emotional and yes it's hard but daycare is gonna be really good for you for her for socializing and whatnot and they're licensed professionals that work there and they're taking good care of the babies when I was trying to like mentally prepare myself for this first day or first week or whatever of daycare I tried to look up some like videos about babies and daycare on YouTube and that made it so much worse because there's just so many experts talking about how horrible daycare is for babies and how the second you have a baby you need to be a stay-at-home mom and be home with your baby and all and it just made me feel so much worse and it really sucks because there's also the other side of the whole situation I would love to be able to stay at home with my baby but it financially doesn't make sense for our family this money is not the most important thing and yes being with your baby is more important but if parents are constantly stressed out about money if parents cannot afford basic things that is also not the best case scenario so my husband and I realized that in our situation it financially does not make sense for me to stay at home so we were lucky enough to be able to cover her care just between the two of us for the first four months and then we had to start daycare and I think we got really lucky with our daycare situation it, the center has really good reviews and it's also like just a few minute walk away from our house um, so that's really nice because actually I'm gonna leave my car at home and then go pick her up and we can go on a walk right after and the daycare doesn't have cameras that like we can log in and watch her but um, they use this app where they log everything they log her like, naps her diapers her feet um, and they also take pictures and send pictures so today we probably got like a I don't know maybe like 10 different pictures and she looked really happy in all of them and <laughs> that again made me it made me feel better obviously but also just seeing my baby so happy in hands of another woman was really hard 
and then I felt really selfish for feeling sad about that. I know it's gonna get better, I know it's gonna get easier, and arguably starting daycare when babies are this young might even be better because she will be used to it, she'll be used to uh, seeing her friends and the teachers, other people before she develops that separation anxiety, before she can like, really understand what happened, what's happening. So that's probably a good thing and it makes me feel good that we're starting her at the daycare while I'm still breastfeeding because that is gonna help to protect her and strengthen her immune system. It's also gonna be great for socializing her. So in the long run, I know it's a good thing for her, for us, for our family. She's only going there three days a week and the rest we're covering, my husband and I. I know it's gonna be okay, but this first day has been incredibly hard and very emotional and very emotional both for me and for my husband. If you're watching this because your baby is about to start daycare, it's really hard. Yes, it is. It is very hard, but you're not alone and it's gonna get better. Don't feel guilty for sending your baby to daycare. We are doing the best we can. We're doing what is best for us and for our families. And that's not always just staying home with your baby. So it really sucks. And like I said, the whole childcare situation in the States joke 12 weeks of maternity leave and that's if you're lucky if you, if you stayed with your job for over a year before that as if length of your employment changes the amount of time that your baby needs you it's just ridiculous i am from eastern europe and maternity leave is fully paid there for three years and you're guaranteed to your job back